Bright Ideas for Tennis is a charity that, that gives uh, tennis clubs in the UK an opportunity to fundraise for themselves. So, say you're a tennis club, um, we would provide two Davis Cup players to come to your venue for the day. They would provide a series of coaching clinics um, from minis through to adult team players. Uh, we'd play a, a tennis exhibition, we'd have a fastest serve competition, we'd encourage the club to run a, a raffle or an auction and to host a barbecue and all proceeds from that day would remain at the club for your use. What's happening behind me right now, we've got one of the best players this country's ever produced in Tim Hemman, and he's very kindly donated his time to come to this club in North Dulwich. And you can see um, the excitement around the club. I don't think this club's ever seen so many people in one day, and they've raised a lot of funds to try and improve those courts at the back. There's two shell courts there which they're looking to replace with all weather. The, the ironic thing about Dulwich is uh that they are one of the smaller clubs that we visited. They've got this, one of the smaller memberships, um, but they're, they're so passionate and so committed and so enthusiastic that they've raised the most amount of money. So it just shows you that a, that a four-court club can achieve uh, big things. And as a result of raising, um, obviously, the most amount of money out of the 50 charities days that we did this year, um, they received a day with our ambassador, Tim Hemman. It's, it's not only about benefiting the clubs but also the local community. I think the more and more kids we can get playing the game, um, get the atmosphere right in, in, in the clubs, then you know tennis, tennis will benefit and, and uh, the community benefit. Successes today, in our first year we've raised uh, over £100,000 uh, for the clubs that we visited. Uh, we've managed to coach in excess of 3,000 members um, and we've provided further funding for another 2,000 hours of free coaching um, for the local community. They can uh, provide some outreach at local schools, um, talent ID some local kids and bring them back to the club. Um, there's a whole array of, of things that they can use that money for, um, as long as it's charitable and as long as it gets more people playing more tennis, um, then we as a charity are happy. I think there's a lot of clubs throughout the whole country that are really struggling to make ends meet. So if we can you know, raise some money, provide uh, um, coaching and, and get more and more um, members, perhaps uh, you know, it's these clubs that are so important for the, for the future of the game. What I genuinely love about my role at the charity is, uh, is receiving the feedback from the, from the players, from the participants. Um, if we've managed to inspire some kids, if we've managed to, to encourage adults to take up tennis for the first time. Um, the amount of times I've heard uh, players tell me that they've had a fantastic time and they didn't actually realise that the club was actually on their doorsteps. I've known Danny for a long, long time, and, and uh, I've been really impressed with his, uh, you know, passion and enthusiasm for um, for the initiatives and, and getting more and more kids playing in clubs. Um, I think they're they're great because they're they're big enough to cope, but they're small enough to care. I'm trying I'm trying to convince people that by going to the different clubs that I go to, I can recognise which ones are the good ones yep. which and one which ones are the more Because <laughs> all they see is an application on no, a bit of paper. Exactly. So I'm going to try and convince them that if they can ring fence a bit of money that I can recommend, that this club fun. deserves a bit, or maybe Thank this club. You. And Danny, so you've done so much for us, during the age board new members. No, gr and brilliant. No, good. also all today, good. we've had two donations really? of non-members that have just come to the day, brilliant. and they're happy to actually donate Check, some money. So whether it's £100 or 150 Fantastic. More than happy. Brilliant, so. brilliant. So if you're a club and you're passionate about growing, uh, we'd love to hear from you, so please give us a call. If you're a business and you'd like to take advantage of our fundraising days to raise your visibility in the local community, or if you're an organisation that has a strong sense of social corporate responsibility, please get in touch. Um, we'd, love, we'd love you to help.